We live in a world where people do not care for sin. And the majority of churches preach and say that we are all sinners. Dear friends, the unrighteous will burn in hell. They will not go into the kingdom of heaven. I remind us of the words of Paul in 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 9, where Paul says, Or do you not know that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Do not be deceived. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor homosexuals, nor thieves, nor the covetous, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor swindlers, shall inherit the kingdom of God. And such were some of you, but you were washed, but you were sanctified, but you were justified in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, and in the Spirit of our Lord. Dear friends, a God standard of holiness is absolute. No sin will go into the kingdom of heaven. A person who is a child of God is born again. And he is perfect in his obedience to Jesus Christ because he follows Jesus every day of his life without exception. His mind is set on Christ. He is led by the Holy Spirit of God that lives in him and he does not sin. He does the will of God. He is a disciple. I want to also read for you the words of Paul in 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 17. He says, But the one who joins himself to the Lord is one spirit with him. If we join ourselves with Jesus Christ, we become one spirit with him, dear friends. We are either one spirit with the devil or we are one with the Spirit of God and we are holy and absolutely obedient to the Holy Spirit that indwells us. Verse 18, he says, Free immorality. Every other sin that a man commits is outside of the body, but the immoral man sins against his own body. Or do you not know that your body is a temple of the Holy Spirit who is in you, whom you have from God, and that you are not your own? For you have been bought with a price, therefore glorify God in your body. Dear friends, if we belong to Jesus Christ, then we reserve ourselves for Him, and we do not participate in the lusts of the flesh and the things of this world. We are holy men and women. We are children of God. We are righteous. And let us remember, dear friends, the unrighteous will burn in hell. No sinners will go into the kingdom of heaven. If we follow Jesus, then we are righteous as He is righteous. We are born again. We are new. All the old things are passed away. And in newness of spirit, we follow Him and we do the will of the Father. And that is the only way that we will enter the kingdom of heaven. Be holy. Be righteous. Obey Jesus Christ. May Jesus bless you.